And boy, am I bullish. With that out of the way, with that out of the way, we got to take a look at the current structure and where we are currently. Now, when Bitcoin breaks out, it usually just goes. Today, we have come up against the resistance of this yellow channel that I've had marked on this chart for weeks. Um, this is technically a resistance point, but I would not be surprised if we just tear right through it, okay? But let's pretend that maybe we don't tear right through it. Let What would be some of the significant uh, support levels that I would be looking at in the event that we got some sort of a pullback, uh, all-time high, the all-time high, the prior all-time high is an easy one. Let's uh, let's highlight that a little bit more clearly with a brighter color. You know, what? let's get rid of. No, what we'll do is we'll put a box from the weekly, the weekly support to the all-time high, the technical all-time high. We'll do something like this. So I would be looking at some sort of a pullback in this range if Bitcoin does take a pullback. Again, what what one thing that Bitcoin does quite often, specifically after long-term accumulations, it doesn't always do this, but if you take a look back in history after long-term accumulations, it breaks out and it just fucks off and it doesn't pull back. 